When Allah tests you it is never to destroy you. When he removes something in your possession it is only in order to empty your hands for an even greater gift. This worldly life is like a shadow. If you try to catch it, you will never be able to do so. If you turn your back towards it, it has no choice but to follow you. A real man is one who fears the death of his heart, not of his body. Happiness is attained by three things, being patient when tested, being thankful when receiving a blessing, and being repentant upon sinning. If a heart becomes attached to anything other than Allah, Allah makes him dependent on what he is attached to, and he will be betrayed by it. If you knew the true value of yourself, you will never allow yourself to be humiliated by committing sins. Women are one half of society which gives birth to the other half so it is as if they are the entire society. Patience is that the heart does not feel anger towards that which is destined and that the mouth does not complain. Be sincere in your aiming you will find the support of Alea surrounding you. How strange. You lose a little from you and you cry. And your whole life is wasting in your laughing. If you wish to check how much you love Allah, then see how much your heart loves the Quran, and you will know the answer. Beware of every hour and how it passes, and only spend it in the best possible way. Do not neglect yourself, but render it accustomed to the noblest and best of actions, and send to your grave that which will please you when you arrive to it. When there is money in your hand and not in your heart, it will not harm you even if it is a lot, and when it is in your heart, it will harm you even if there is none in your hands. As long as you are performing prayer, you are knocking at the door of Allah, and whoever is knocking at the door of Allah, Allah will open it for him. Speech remains as a slave to you, but the moment it leaves your mouth, you become its slave. Sitting with the poor and less fortunate people removes the ego and pride from your heart. He who keeps his heart near God will find peace and tranquility whilst he who gives his heart to the people will find restlessness and apprehension.